Okay, hello, and welcome to what I'm sure will be another very short stream. <laughs> All I know is that my roommate is getting home early again, but when early is, is the mystery. So, I don't know how many seconds I have before I have to cut out the noise. <sighs> so, I'm going to try to get a couple more seconds of gameplay in before that happens. So anyway, uh, this is part three of my <laughs> third attempt at a legacy challenge. Earlier today I was playing my last attempt. I got um, the third generation heir to toddler. That's as far as I've gotten so far. But um, if you saw the first couple parts, or at least the last part, you know that we now have an heir. Like, literally just had an heir. That's where her water broke. So, and it's a boy, and I gave him his dad's last name because that's what makes sense. And I gave him the first B name I saw on the random name generator, which is Bradford. Not a fan of that name, but oh well. <laughs> He's going to be dead soon anyway because we know how I feel about default lifespans, don't we? Anyway, um, so we have an heir now. Uh, her and Akira still are only at, I don't even know. If they're still romantic interests, or oh, they're lovebirds now. Akira's the dad, in case anybody missed that. Now, um, you'll see in the <laughs> in the title I put mature, because I'm never sure I'm going to be able to move the camera quick enough to uh, get around certain camera angles. But again, the terms of service said nudity is allowed as long as it's not the focus. So hopefully they won't give me too much grief over it. But anyway. Um, okay, I told you to have fun, so you decided to... I got I got her this bookcase, because she, her font is always, like, really, really crappy. Well, I guess she's finally figured out that she has a bookcase now. But, yeah, um, she still doesn't have the house built. Down to 400 bucks. Gotta love the legacy challenge. We can't even afford a house, but let's hurry up and have a kid. Because that makes absolute perfect sense, right? Anyway, uh, so it is 2.30 in the morning. She just had this kid, like, literally right at the end of the last stream. So, <laughs> not a lot I can do with her right now. I think she's still in... Oh, it's the weekend. That's right, it's the weekend, so I don't have to worry about the whole family thing. But that also means no money. But her fun is up a little bit now. And I decided to have her, since she got the family point, sort of. Well, the kid's got to get to young adult to get that point, but, um, and technically she should have the love point because Akira does have three different traits than her, even though he's not officially her spouse, but he is the father of the heir. So, um, I decided the next point to work on is creativity, which is getting somebody to level eight of some creative skill and then doing a certain thing, like painting from reference, writing a song, comedy routine, etc, etc, to memorialize the founder and their spouse and that takes a really long time so I've been like forcing this poor girl to paint constantly but it gets us a little bit more money so I'm trying to decide if I should force her to paint or let her do what she wants but her mood is okay at the moment usually she paints on her own is the thing I don't know I guess we'll do a little bit of painting so yeah but she has an air now Still can't afford to finish building her house. What else is new, right? Uh -huh. I think the AC is off again, because it's really freaking hot in here. No. Um, so anyway, oh. let's see. Uh -huh. I'm getting weird messages oh. from Twitch. All right. Oh. What was that? Jocelyn something something? Mm. Oh, the kid that was born two seconds ago is already a child. Okay, great. I love oh. default lifespans. <laughs> Sorry, it's hard for me to be enthusiastic when I know I'm going to get interrupted and have to quit, like, at any second. I'm going to crack the window, though, because I think they turned off the air conditioning again. So, I'm roasting a bit. Okay. So, anyway. Alright. So, like I was saying, I'm trying to get her the creativity point for the Legacy Challenge, even though I still don't get what the point of the scoring is at all. It's not like you're going to get a prize or something. Uh, but anyway, 
because it says the challenge ends when the tenth generation child is born, so, you know. Oh. It doesn't really matter what your score is, it's just that's when it ends. Alright, so, I guess I'm going to keep making her paint. I'm doing small because she doesn't really have a lot of money. Oh. <laughs> yeah, she should be going to bed because it's four in the morning, but... I wait till she's tired. I'm not gonna make her go to bed. Oh, and her fun sucks again. What else is new? Fine. Oh. After you're done painting, read something, get your fun up. Ah. We'll fast forward a bit. I usually, like I said before, I only fast forward when there's nobody around for her to talk to. Or when there's not anything that I have to do at a certain time. Oh crap. You are hungry too. Alright. Oh, reach painting level four. Okay, great. So, finish painting, then eat something. This exact same painting you just made. Oh, that's right, I have to put the walls down because partial walls don't disappear like they're supposed to. Alright, then read something. Yeah, we know Mortimer and Bella are having problems. The problem being that she screwed the hottest guy in town, and it wasn't Mortimer. Not that I want to kill her because of that. Oh, wait, yes, I do. But anyway, I mean, it wasn't Akira, but. It was the guy I would have chosen if he wasn't a vampire. <laughs> Just because vampires don't work for the Legacy Challenge. I know they say you can use a vampire for the Legacy Challenge, but I refuse to let my vampires have babies because it's ridiculous. Why didn't you eat? Didn't I tell you to eat? Okay, crazy girl. Why didn't you eat? But yeah, Caleb is my favorite guy in the town, but um, he's a vampire. And I refuse oh, to let vampires have ninja. babies, because that's absolutely BS and ridiculous. Uh. They're dead. They can't have babies. I don't care how many stupid authors and movie writers think that they can. They can't. Um, so, that's the only reason I didn't go after Caleb. But, still, I don't want to see anybody else with him either. You. <laughs> Especially somebody who's already married. I mean, come on. And now she's tired. Girl, you got so many problems. <laughs> Did you actually finish eating? No. I don't get why she's, like, not finishing eating, even though I tell her to. Weirdo. <laughs> okay. Fun. Okay, read something. <laughs> you want to play an instrument? You can't afford walls, but you think you can buy an instrument. That is hilarious. But yeah, um, I have my game set to realistic, which is why I put the mature thing in the tag. I still wish somebody would explain to me accurately when, what is considered like the focus of the game, because I'm so afraid to like leave the camera on anything just because I don't know what's considered the focus of the game. And I find it ridiculous, because censorship is ridiculous. And plus, they're cartoons. Who cares if they're negative, right? But anyway... <laughs> oh, it just really irks me that I either have to play the game like I'm in kindergarten, or keep moving the camera, because I don't know what the focus of the game is considered. So, I don't know. Because it was really upsetting the first time she was with Akira, I'm like, well... I would like to actually have my camera on my sim because it's a big event in her life, but alas, I don't know <laughs> what they'd say. So, not that anybody's watching my channel anyway, so it doesn't really matter, I guess. <laughs> I still have 20 of the 50 followers you need for the one requirement. It's um, 50 followers and a certain number of consecutive viewers. I don't even remember what the number is. I read it so long ago, because I haven't been able to stream for a long time. I still really can't stream, but I kind of have no choice. I have to stream, uh, because I absolutely have to get a new place to live, like, as soon as humanly freaking possible. So, I kind of have to stream, even though it's almost impossible for me to find enough time for it to be quiet enough for me to stream. It's like 12 hours a week, max. It's quiet. <laughs> 
and it's usually like between midnight and 4 a.m. But lately it's been between midnight and 2 a.m. So not even that much anymore. So I don't know. Now she wants to chat with somebody. All right. Well, it's after seven, so I guess you can call baby daddy. Cause uh, I have, I could have just moved him in as soon as she got pregnant. But as I was saying last night, I don't usually move anyone in with my sim unless they're officially in a relationship. And even though she had his kid, her and Akira are not officially in a relationship, so I'm not moving him in until she gets the whim to ask him to be her boyfriend, or whatever, and he says yes, then I will move him in, and only then. Because, as I was saying before, if somebody isn't even willing to be in an exclusive relationship, they're most likely not going to want to live with you. <laughs> so, you know. I... You read really slow, and now you're hungry again. Oh my god, girl. Maybe if you finished your food the 14 times I told you to eat it, you wouldn't be so hungry. <laughs> One bite oh, left. Binja. Thank goodness she likes fruitcake, or else we'd be having her bitching about that now, too. Her mood is a little better now that she's not pregnant, at least. <laughs> Alright. Call him up, because you want to <laughs> chat. It's still weird how sometimes you get credit for that when you talk on the phone or the computer, and sometimes you actually have to talk in person to get credit. Although I really shouldn't be worried about her whims right now. You know, although I was saying that now that she got her potion, her youth potion, I don't have to worry about her whims as much, but I was thinking that she's actually going to have to get a potion for Akira if he does move in. Because she is aging up in 15 days, which means he's aging up in 12 because sims magically stop aging when they're pregnant, because that makes so much sense. Okay, let's see if I can get her to paint again. Realism painting, alright. I'm only telling her to paint because she needs to get to the creativity 8 for that point, and plus it gets her some money during the weekend when she's not working. Uh -huh. Okay, let's fast forward while she's painting yeah. that. But yeah, um, I got her her youth potion. But like I was saying, since she magically stopped aging when she was pregnant, not that I really have a major problem with that uh -huh. whole theory. It really irks me in um, my regular game. I actually have it set. That's one of my custom paintings. But um... I have it set so that they actually do age when they're pregnant, because that makes no bloody sense whatsoever. Um, but I guess it's really good when you have default lifespans that she stopped aging, because she'll live a little longer. A little longer. Oh, did she finally run out of... Yeah, she finally ran out of leftovers. Alright, and she's hungry and she's tired. My god, girl. Clean that up. Clean that up. Always tell her to make a group meal so that she has food for a couple days. I haven't made BLTs yet. Let's do that. But yeah, um, I gotta. I probably should work on her whims if I can because Akira's gonna need that potion bad. Because he's gonna be older than her now. But yeah, uh, when I'm playing with my default lifespans, I have um, pregnancy aging on. Because having kids makes you older, not younger. Thank you. Um, <laughs> so I have pregnancy aging on. Plus my lifespans are so long it doesn't really matter if, she, if she's about to... Like, if she's... It doesn't matter how long she's got left because she always has a really long time left. What? Why do you do that? Why, why, why? You crazy person. Why are you doing that? Well, if you would have actually gotten rid of that, you would have had a counter now, wouldn't you? That's why I told you to clean it up, dummy. Resume your damn food, woman. Okay. I love my sims. Can't you tell? Okay. Looks like the delay is not too terrible today. Maybe about ten seconds. It was really bad for a while last night. But... I 
I gotta really watch the clock. I'm probably gonna have to stop at 2 or 2.15, maybe earlier. I honestly don't know. Okay. <laughs> oh, it's the day. You cook slow. Okay. Put that away. Oh, now you want to make a meal. You just made a meal, dummy. Please have some concept of reality. I know I'm asking a lot. Okay. Oh, did she ma finish that too? I think that's another custom one. Yeah, that's another custom one. So we'll sell that. Let's see, it's 12.30 in the afternoon. We'll have her take a nap. If she ever gets done eating. At least she didn't cancel it out this time. <laughs> Hey, come on. Kid's gonna be crying in a second anyway. Oh yeah, that's another thing I'm gonna need money for. I'm gonna have to change the shower to a bathtub because the kid's gonna be a toddler in about a freaking second. See, with my def with my lifespans that I normally play with, a baby's a baby for 15 days because 10 days equals one year in my mind, so that's a year and a half. It's a baby, so. But now, in this game, it's a only baby for... <laughs> okay, I'm getting that glitch again. Do you see this? Do you see this crap? Does it say he's hungry? He's. It says he's happy, not hungry. <sighs> so, I'm going to try to fix the glitch by quickly going... Oh crap, I think I just saved over my other thing. Alright, because I forgot to hit save as. Let me check real quick. Okay, now it, it kept it good. But I'm going to do save as just in case. But yeah, a lot of glitches you can fix by going to the neighborhood screen and then going back into the lot. But you saw it all here. Um... It said the kid was happy, and then I got the warning saying he was very hungry, and it said he was happy. I hate that glitch. I hate it so bad. I mean, when the kid's only a baby for two days, I guess it doesn't matter much, but when I'm playing normally, and the kid's a, a baby for 15 days and you get that glitch, it's like, really? Don't tell me that I'm not taking care of the kid when there was absolutely no warning whatsoever. Again! I'm still... How am I supposed to know when I have to take care of this kid when I'm getting that stupid freaking glitch? Oh my god, seriously? Seriously, man? I hate glitches so bad. You saw it. The kid was not complaining, was not crying, nothing. But I'm getting a warning saying he's very hungry, he's going to be taken away. And he still says he's fine. Whatever. I hate glitches and make me rage. Seriously. And she has to go to the bathroom too. Hurry up. Hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. And then hopefully I can make her paint again. Who's calling Paolo? Whatever, dude. <laughs> Meet someone new? Let's see. Who's wandering around? But that's going to be really problematic if I've got this continuous baby glitch. So I'm going to reload yet again, because obviously it did not freaking fix it. Don't know how else to fix it other than resetting the kid. I don't know, can you even reset babies? I don't know. I really don't know. If I get the warning again when the kid says he's perfectly happy, I'm going to have to try to reset him. because that is going to be beyond annoying. Come on, hurry up. Game's just confused now. Why do you keep reloading? Well, why do you keep glitching me? Give me that answer and I'll give you mine. Okay. <laughs> anyway. All right. 
now kid, you better be fine. You better not say you're having an issue when it says you're perfectly happy. All right. Now she's freaking tired again. God, woman. I mean, I could just make her go to sleep sleep, but she works 9 to 5, so that'll throw off her entire sleep schedule. But I guess having a kid at, like, midnight kind of threw things off anyway. Olivia Kim Lewis is aged up to teen. Oh. Sorry about your dad being a dog, chick. Aaron and Jasmine are still in marriage counseling. Okay, she wants to read a vampire book. Oh, Lord. Meet somebody new. Still? No, make a friend. Buy a hot tub. But I also need to worry about getting her her dang creativity point. Um or four more creativity points, right? She's only at painting four. Um, make a friend. See, I could buy her the vampire book, but I need to worry about buying the suet bathtub in a second as well. Make a friend. Okay, let's send a text to somebody who's not super annoying. That'll add to their friendship at least. Don't really want to spend 75 bucks on a vampire book, even though that's a whim she has. I guess I'll do it. I don't even give a crap at this point. I'm never going to have money in this <laughs> stupid thing. Alright, speaking of money, let's have you make another painting. <laughs> oh, well, at least the kid glitch is fixed. Oh. Thank freaking goodness. Okay. For now, anyway. Why can't you just click on the damn easel, woman? Alright. There. Make another painting, because we gotta buy a bathtub in a second. And we still gotta get our walls built. And our bills are like almost 400 a week. Caleb wants to come over. What, is Bella busy with her husband and kids tonight? Is that it? Not that I'm bitter. Not that I have a steak waiting for you. Shove it in your heart, put you to sleep for a few decades, make you think about your actions. <laughs> Alright, anyway. Hi, Caleb. Uh -huh. Yeah, go knock on my bathroom door. That's brilliant. Ask to turn. Uh... I don't want to brighten your day. I'm pissed at you still. Uh, Hurry up and finish your painting. Uh, uh, <laughs> I'm so annoyed at Caleb, but I always say yes when somebody wants to come over because it's a lot easier than um, always constantly having to send her out to socialize, especially with all the weird glitches that's been happening. <laughs> Would you finish your painting and go talk to the jerk before he leaves and ah. goes and screws around with Bella some more? Okay. Sell that. Hi, jerk. You're really hot, but you're a jerk. How are you today? <laughs> Nothing jerk-like to do today? Okay. Oh. <laughs> I don't get why he's a foodie. He's a vampire. Food has no place in his life. But you know, I um, in one of my games, I ended up ending up. I ended up with Caleb as my Sims boyfriend and moved him in. He has 900 points for vampire powers. Nine freaking hundred. Oh my god. And he had, had, didn't even buy half of his uh, half of his things that he could have bought. So I bought him the ones that make sense for vampires. But he still had like 700, 800. I don't even remember. Boy's got a lot of points. So apparently you keep getting points um, once you hit Vampire Grandmaster. I haven't really played vampires long enough. I think the highest I got one too was... I might have gotten one to Grandmaster once, but I think the highest I got one too was Master. But anyway. Uh -huh. 
Oh, my. See, it's like, Caleb's here and she should be <laughs> talking to him, but one, I'm mad at him, two, she needs to keep painting because she needs money so she can build her dang house already. <laughs> oh, my. What kind of painting are you even doing? Realism. Alright, read a vampire book. Yeah, because Caleb knows nothing about vampires. You ask him and he's like, I don't know. It's like, alright. Apparently you don't know how to spend your 900 points either. You have food in the fridge. You don't need to cook any more food, woman. Weirdo. Sell your... I really wish there was some setting in MC Command Center or something that would make them automatically sell paintings. I'm so sick of constantly having to tell her to sell her paintings. Now she's tired. I normally don't tell them to go to sleep when they've got people visiting, but I guess she's going to go to sleep anyway. And since Caleb's here, it's not going to fast forward. Well, Caleb, have fun babysitting the kids since you're going to be up all night anyway, bud. <laughs> Alright. Okay. <sighs> well, at least having the kid right next to her makes her quickly wake up when it cries. That is not what the kid needs, babe. And Caleb's still here, just hanging out in the bathroom. Not weird at all. Okay. Get leftovers. Hurry up and take care of that kid. Caleb... Why are you having such an energy issue? Oh lord. Okay then. Apparently I was right when I thought Caleb was hot. She apparently agrees. She doesn't want to eat. She wants to do that instead. What are you even... Yeah. Is Caleb just like watching? <laughs> yeah. All right then. <laughs> He's leaving. What the hell? <laughs> Seriously, dude. Uh, that's just too weird. It's like, okay, she's laying there on the floor in the bathroom, doing things to herself, and he's just like, I should go. <laughs> now, if that was it, an invitation came up. I don't know what was. All right, earn one hundred dollars from painting. Gain parenting skill. Finish a painting. Well, that all seems pretty simple, but I need to get her some food. Okay, you have fun, dear. <laughs> all right, then. And the person who was watching just left <laughs> right before all this insanity. And now I gotta deal with the kid, too. Let's see if we can quickly move the camera. I can't, I can't click on the kid until she's done. It's gonna take her a while takes three three hours game time, but only three minutes of real life, but three minutes is a long time when you're like waiting on something to get done. Alright, hurry up and finish so you can take care of your kid. I can't even click to see what's wrong with it. It must want food because I'm not seeing like the green steam coming off of it. Hurry up and finish. You got a baby crying, girl. Alright. Guess we can fast forward. Hurry up, girl. You gotta go take care of your kid. Hurry up. Yes, it's almost his birthday, yippee, which means we have to get um the stupid bathtub. Are you done finally? Alright. So and now I gotta make her eat too after she's done taking care of this kid. All right. Does the kid need a diaper change now too? No. Okay, it just was taking a while to go unblue. Get some food. Take a shower. And it said almost, almost his birthday, which is what one, 
one day then, that means? I don't know. I'm not used to these default lifespans at all. <laughs> it's like, how long is this kid going to be a kid? Two days? That's not ridiculous at all. Yeah, let's fix Malcolm here. I like that mod, but <laughs> I really wish it didn't do that. Put stupid crap in people's hands all the time. Alright. Eat faster, because you got to get a shower. And... It's 2 a.m. I really should make her go to bed, but she's not quite in the yellow yet. Okay. I'm going to keep fast forwarding because that shower takes her forever. Because it's crappy. Okay, now she's tired. Okay. She should sleep sleep since it's so late. Instead of just fake sleep. Yeah, we know Bjorn and Clara are in counseling, we know. Oh, don't go to sleep. Brat's crying again. I guess you already went to sleep. Get up, take care of this kid. She would have woke up on her own anyway, because I left him next to her, since she doesn't really have any other rooms other than the bathroom. Not exactly room in there for the kid. Uh -huh. Hit bump somebody, gain parenting skill, earn $100 from painting as well. I guess we'll make you paint real quick before you're tiredness goes again. And I guess I'll wait till the kid's a toddler before I switch out the shower for a bathtub. The shower's slow enough and the bathtub will be even slower, I'm sure. Lino. Okay. Hurry up and finish your painting. Then you probably will be tired again like you are. Okay. Watch her take a nap since it's like already freaking 4 a.m. now. And then she'll be dead when she gets home. Whatever, girl. Whatever. Do what you want. See if I care. Your problem. Alright. Anyway. Hurry up. Paint faster. Yeah, she's just taking a nap. Like a dummy. Okay. Go to the bathroom. She's up to 630. Hmm. Yeah, I'm trying to remember how much the cheapest bathtub is. I think it's like 200 and some crap. Hurry up. Let's see, discuss fitness techniques. Read vampire book by an instrument. Uh, what is her points now? I mean, she's got her potion, but Akira's gonna need one. Really, before she does, even. Alright, I guess she'll paint anyway, because she went and did it on her own. What's she painting now? Realism again. Okay. People, like, keep popping in and then popping back out. <laughs> I don't know. Ugh, kid. Seriously. Go. <laughs> Alright. Then let's see if we can get her to finish her painting before work. Oh, she's really tired, too. Uh, what's... So, how many... Oh, she doesn't work today? Oh, it's Sunday. I was thinking it was Monday. I, I don't even know what day it is at this point. Kind of like real life, usually. Okay, actually, just go to sleep. You can finish your painting later. I thought you had to go to work, but you don't. <laughs> All right. Cassandra Goth is aged up to young adult. Yeah, isn't her mom a young adult too? Because that doesn't defy the laws of physics. Alexander Goth is a teen. Oh lord, we're getting an age bomb. All the townies are aging up. Okay. Cassandra's a young adult. Alexander's a teen. Darling is a young adult. Luna is a young adult. Hugo's a young adult. Max is a teen.
Come on, why are you, like, not... Oh, because we're still getting the age bomb. Lucas Munch is a teen, Billy Jang's a teen, Elsa's a teen, Yuki's a young adult, Morgan's a young adult. Oh, she was a teen? Hmm. Aaron and Jesminder are in marriage counseling again. The Ho's son is a young adult. Um, Caleb's a young adult. Different Caleb. Cruz is a young adult and he's already got like 15 kids or something. Yang, okay, is a teen. Eileen's a teen. Keaton's a young adult. Okay, can we please like stop getting age bombed now? Alright, discuss fitness techniques. I don't even know why I'm looking at that crap. But like I said, Akira's going to need the potion. Now he's going to invite her to the gym. Let's see if you can sell that before you. Yep. Alright, fine. Only because it's Akira. <laughs> the baby daddy. Otherwise, I'm not really going to send her out too much anymore. At least that's the plan. We'll see. God, it's already 1230. I don't know how many seconds I have left to stream tonight. All right, come on, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. I'm on a time limit, and I don't even know what the time limit is. That's not annoying at all. <laughs> oh, my. Come on, let's go. <laughs> She's still in her pajamas. So, Akira. Have any desire to meet your child? It's gonna be a toddler in about a second. <laughs> All right, anyway. You should probably talk to him before he runs off and does something stupid. Let's see if that ticks him off. He's so weird about hey, compliments. <laughs> Seriously, woman, what are you wearing? Change outfit. Don't even remember what the athletic wear looks like. Yeah. I'll just pick the first one. I don't care. Now get a whim to ask him to be your boyfriend. Then we'll move him in, and life will be simpler. She wants a promotion. She's got the shit she needs for a promotion. She just has to go to work. We're just gonna let them chat for a bit. Or not. Okay, yeah, she's just readjusting like they do 15 times during conversation. Yes, I know you want to go jogging. She looks pretty good for having a kid like two days ago, doesn't she? Oh, no, we are not chatting with Bella. I hate Bella now. No. No, no, no. <laughs> no. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. I already hated Bella. Now, I could take things into my own hands here. <laughs> I could take things into my own hands here. Two ways. I can go join them. <laughs> Hit on the little blue haired boy. Oh lord. What are they even doing? So, do I join them? <laughs> or do I kill them? Uh, why am I not getting the option? All right, that's interesting. All right then. Hmm. I'm not getting the option. <laughs> Is 
not even gonna work. It's like I don't even feel like talking to him right now to tell him that. All right then, that's interesting. That's an interesting development, I must say. So much for that other plan of moving Akira in and crap, huh? Literally like right in front of me. He goes to screw around with Bella, who I already hated because of Caleb. I seriously am ready to kill Bella. I'm seriously ready to murder this little slut. Alright then. I guess we're moving on, because Akira is a scumbag and he needs to die, and I will be hard pressed not to murder Bella the second I see her. Hmm. Interesting. Interesting development, I must say. There's no join in option, which is odd. Although I'd, I'm, I'd probably be too annoyed to join in just because of the sheer annoyance of it all. Um, I don't know. Um, well, guess what? I don't think I'm going to get you your potion, Akira. Maybe some arsenic. I might get you that. All right. All right then. Interesting. Interesting. Definitely an interesting development. I literally don't know what to do. I want to go up there and murder them, but I have to wait till they're done anyway. Or I could just, you know, move on to Psy here. Oh, <laughs> uh, okay. Um, yeah. I literally don't know what to do. I want to kill them, but I have to wait till they're done before I can. Um, I can't join in, although I'd probably be too annoyed to do that anyway. So, hmm. Could move on to Psy. I mean, he screwed around with some other chick, but that was like before I even said more than hi to him. I literally said hi to him and then he went off to it with her. So <laughs> it's a little different with Akira, considering she just had his baby and now he's screwing around with Bella, who is married, by the way. Um, you know what I want to do? You know what I want to do? I'm inviting Mortimer to the gym. That's what I'm going to do first. Can invite Mortimer to the gym if it didn't cancel out for some god awful reason. Oh, okay, and now it's not letting me do that. Is he here already? <laughs> then we'll go talk to Sai and forget that Akira exists because if I see him, I will kill him. Yeah. And there's no join option, which is really strange. Where is Mortimer at? Is he here? Why can't I? I just want to talk to Mortimer and, and invite him to talk with me upstairs right next to that window. That's what I want to do. Hey, Caleb, guess what Bella's doing? Or should I say who Bella's doing? The one whose baby I just had two days ago. So you have good taste in women, don't you, Caleb? Alright. Where the frick is Mortimer? I really wanted to invite him over. And then have him chat with me right next to Bella and Akira. Maybe he'll kill her for me. <laughs> Yay, get to go upstairs. I 
I'm seriously ready to kill her. I'm seriously ready to kill her. I'm seriously ready to kill her. I mean, it was bad enough when it was Caleb. But two days after I have Akira's baby, and she's married. And I was with Akira at the time. She deserves to die. She seriously deserves to die. She seriously deserves to die. There's just no forgiveness for her, her crap. None at all. None. I mean, first she cheated on her husband with Caleb and some other dude. Then she cheats on him with Akira while I'm with Akira two days after I had his baby. She really does need to die. She, she seriously needs to die. Would you please cook faster? You take so freaking long, woman. Because <sighs> right now I'm, I'm, I'm planning whether or not I should try murdering her and risk my reputation. But she so needs to die. She seriously needs to die. Mm-hmm. Looks like they're done. Oh, Lord. Where is Bella? Where is she? Well, she's in the shower. Hurry up and eat, woman. Hurry up. You got stuff to do. All right, I know how I'll do this. Hurry up and eat. Hurry up and eat. Hurry up and eat. You've got stuff to do. <laughs> I know how I'm going to do this. I know how I'm going to do this. Bella and her have spoken at some point, which means she's in her relationship panel. Eat faster. Just eat faster. You've got stuff to do. Come on, hurry up. You got stuff to do. You got stuff that needs to be done. <laughs> Pronto. Hurry up. I don't care if you're tired. Hurry up and eat. Then you can go home. Then you're inviting Bella over. Yep. Mm -hmm. It's gotta be done. It's gotta be done, folks. There, There is no forgiveness for that. None whatsoever. Hurry up. Oh my god, why are you eating so slow? <laughs> It's in double speed, oh, and she's still yeah. taking 14 hours to eat. Come on, hurry up. Go home. You gotta invite Bella over. We've gotta rid the world of the biggest slut that ever walked. She's like, moved Elise off the throne. There's no forgiveness for that crap. Two days after I have his kid, I'm standing right next to him, and she comes on to him. After she already scared Caleb. And she's married. Something's got to be done about her. Anybody want to see the extreme violence mod? Because you're going to. I'm not going to put up with her crap. No. I'm just not going to let her get away with that. Period. <laughs> I'm not having it. I'm sure there'll be some other girl that'll, you know, <laughs> take over for Bella as soon as she's gone. But it's got to be done. It's got to be done. <laughs> I mean... Seriously, there is no forgiveness for that. I'm standing right next to him. Had his kid two days earlier, and she does that when she's married and already screwed Caleb. There's just no, there, no, I'm not letting her get away with that. It, it's, it's not acceptable. I am not letting her get away with it. Hey, Bella, want to come over? <laughs> <laughs> it's gotta be done. It's just gotta be done. And she's coming over. Hurry up and change his kid's diaper. You got stuff to do. Oh. <laughs> mm hmm. Okay, there's Luna. Mm. I, 
got to get her in a conversation. Then we got to bring her to the back because there's too many idiots walking past. It's got to be done. It's got to be done. Come on. Let's go behind my half of a house. This needs to be done. I need to save the world from your brand of whorishness. Okay. Why is there so many people walking past all of a sudden? I'm behind the house, so I don't think they'll notice me. All right, people, go away. Hurry up. Go away, people. Go away, people. Go away. Go away. Go away. Go away. Go away. Come on. <sighs> Screw it. She's far enough away. She's probably not going to... She's probably going to see anyway. Okay. We got to do it. We got to do it. <laughs> it needed to be done. I have murdered myself. Okay. Sure. Hey, Grim. What's up? It had to be done. It had to be done. <laughs> At least I made it quick. <laughs> and now she needs a nap. Pulling that trigger was strenuous. <laughs> it had to be done. It had to be done. <laughs> Where's Bella, everybody? Hmm, I wonder. But it had to be done. There's no forgiveness for the crap she pulled. And now my traits, serial killer. This sim has at least killed someone in their life and will not care about other murderers or serial killers. Well, I don't have other ones in the house. <laughs> There's nothing in the legacy challenge that says you can't kill somebody, right? It had to be done. It just, it had to be done. There is no forgiveness for the crap she pulled. Headshot, don't forget to give me back my bullet once you come back as a ghost. Now I'm going to destroy her tombstone, too. She ain't coming back. No, no, no. I never want to see her again. <laughs> it had to be done, though. It had to be done. Hurry up, Grim. She's messing up my backyard. Bella Goth has died. Boo-hoo. Hmm. Let's see. At least spirit to the netherworld, because I never want to see her again. Yeah, I know she passed away. I was the first one to know, as a matter of fact. <laughs> yeah, mourning. Sure. Yeah, I'm so upset. But anyway, it had to be done. It just had to be done. And <laughs> of course, there's nobody watching. <laughs> but <laughs> if they watch this later... Oh, gosh. Thanks for cleaning up the yard, Grim. Hurry up. Oh, my. It had to be done. There's no way, there is no way to forgive that crap. She screwed with Caleb, and then she screwed with Akira right in front of me. Two days after I had his kid. Releasing Bella's soul to the netherworld will forever free her spirit from this mortal realm. Are you sure you want to do this? Yes. Get out, bitch. I don't even want to see your ghost. <laughs> Destroy your tombstone. Then take care of this kid. Daddy's a scumbag, but it's okay. I took care of the bad lady. <laughs> uh, and nobody saw, either. Good. Because she, uh... <laughs> she had spoken to me at some point, so she was in my friends list. 
You need to put the gun away, babe. <laughs> he needs to put the gun away. <laughs> and they're cuddling a baby with a gun in her hand. That, that's perfect. That just looks really wrong. Come on, put the kid down. Okay. See if that'll get rid of it. <laughs> I don't know. Alright. Whatever. <laughs> okay. <laughs> She's playing with the gun for no reason, I guess. And now she has to go to the bathroom. And eat something. It had to be done. It just ha it had to be done. It just had to be done. I couldn't resist. I had to do it. For whoever just <laughs> just uh, tuned in, you just missed my sim killing somebody who uh, deserved it. Really badly deserved it. <laughs> so, <laughs> you missed it. <laughs> There's still some blood in the backyard, though. Trust me, she deserved it. My, it had to be done. It just, it had to be done. I still love this little uh, text. Don't forget to give me back my bullet once you come back as a ghost. <laughs> but she ain't come back as a ghost because I released her spirit and destroyed her tombstone. <laughs> so, anyway. Kid, I'm trying to eat here. Your diaper will wait five seconds. Buy a punching bag, whatever. Okay, um... I gotta buy, oh that's right, the kid is aging up tomorrow, so I need to get a bathtub before I can worry about building the rest of the house. Not that I can really build much of it yet, but anyway. But yeah, you just missed it. Um, not only did Bella Goth uh, screw around with my favorite NPC, Caleb, while she's still married, but two days after I had Akira's kid here, um, she hit on him right in front of me and took him upstairs and uh, did stuff with him. So I invited her over and that's her blood. It had to happen. <laughs> it had to happen. I cannot deal with her anymore. First Caleb, then Akira, two days after I had his kid. No, it had to happen. I'm not putting up with that kind of stuff. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I was talking to Akira and, um, Two days after having the kid, planning on, you know, seeing if he was going to be in a relationship with her and move in with her since they had a kid together, and Bella comes up to him and asks him to go upstairs with her. And I'm like, excuse you, what? So I invited Bella over, and now Bella is no more. It had to happen. But anyway, let's see. Buy a toy. Buy a punching bag. All this crap... You can't even get your house built yet, and you want to buy stupid crap, woman. It just It's not going to happen. you got to buy a bathtub tomorrow anyway. Because of the kid aging up. So just paint some crap while your mood's still good. And she does go back to work tomorrow. Uh-huh. Oh, yeah. It's strange that she's not upset about the puddle of blood when puddles of water make them all antsy. Ah. <laughs> so, hmm. Painting five, yay. Now the question is, do I move her on to another person? Or just let her stay single until she dies in a second? And it is quarter to one. I'm trying to decide when I need to end. Sometime after two. Just deciding when. That it could be before then, for all I know. Depending on how soon people get home. She really likes that painting for some reason. It's like the third time she's painted it. 
All right, 674. Oh, your mood's still good, so keep on painting, even though it's really late. I don't know what she was going to paint, but I canceled out and told her to paint something else. <laughs> Whatever. Well, it's only 11. It's not super late yet. She'll be tired soon enough anyway. Only a real neat freak would attempt to mop a puddle on the natural ground. I've always thought that, too. Nice to see the game agrees. Oh, boy. So, do I try to find her a new man? Or just let her live out her last couple of days? Single. I don't think she should have that mourning thing either. She's not in mourning. Not at all. <laughs> I made it quick, though. I shot her. I could have strangled her or stabbed her or chainsawed her, but I made it quick. I was good. Yes, the much beloved Bella Goth has perished. Well, maybe she shouldn't have been such a little hoe. Let this be a lesson. <laughs> I mean, it was bad enough when it was Caleb, man. But come on. That was unforgivable. Go to sleep, girl. The kid's gonna be crying in a second anyway. And the kid's about to age up to toddler anyway. Yes, it's Bradford's birthday. <laughs> Akira, the scumbag, still hasn't even met his kid. Uh, you're crying. Tough, you're aging up. <laughs> okay. Alright, now I gotta use the little toddler trait generator, which I think is kind of dumb when I can just use random.org, but hey, whatever. I don't know what happens to the game when I have to alt tab, but I'll try to make it quick. Um, all right. Reset generator, generate toddler trait. Inquisitive. Well, at least that's not one of the most annoying ones. Okay. Inquisitive is what I got when I used the random trait generator. I don't know if you could see it or not. I don't think you could, but that's what I got. All right, toddlers. Yay. Curious explorers, these toddlers gain thinking skills slightly faster. They are happiest when learning something and sad if they haven't learned anything lately. <laughs> oh, Akira sent him a gift. Yeah, whatever. Okay, first of all, let's take care of all the stuff we gotta take care of. Generate his multiple outfits. Because for some reason it doesn't do that for toddlers. Not that they really have a lot of clothes, anyway. Okay, and then once it lets me, I'm going to have to go into build mode and get all the toddler crap. Which I can't afford anyway. Now don't go play in Bella's blood. That wouldn't be good. Okay. Oh, uh, now let's get all the toddler crap. that. Get a stupid bathtub. Alright. Cheapest one is 150. Hopefully it'll work even though it's custom. Because a lot of custom crap quit when pets came out. Or sorry, cats and dogs. Alright. Then... Let's see. We'll get uh, the cheapest bed. Guess we'll just set it here for now, since we don't really have rooms. Get the cheapest potty. Set it right there for now. <sighs> I don't know about high chair. It's like, it's annoying, because I'd rather just yank stuff out of the fridge and feed it to them. We'll get it for now. 
All right, so our bills are 400 a week. I, let, I even left a space on my notes for Akira once I moved him in, but I don't know if that's going to happen now. I don't know. So I could stand looking at him, let alone living with him, <laughs> after what he pulled. All right. Let's see, bills are... Would you please stop? Okay, bills are approximately 400 a week. 60, 120... 180, we'll go 120. All right, and I'm gonna do save as, cause I always do save as once uh, a generation ages up instead of just save, just to make sure it's all copesthetic. Okay. Alrighty. I wonder how long that <laughs> puddle of blood is gonna stay in the backyard. It'll be there forever. That's the legacy. Bella's blood in the backyard. Can I eventually build over it anyway. Okay, there. <laughs> Yay, that counted towards her stupid thing. Her aspiration. Okay. Paint a pop art painting. Well, what are you painting? Realism. Apparently you can't read your own whims. Play with Bradford. Play an instrument. Dude. Kid. Seriously, man. Please. Please don't. Please don't. I don't want to have to give you a bath 458 times a day. Okay, so that will work for that. I know half the stupid custom content quit working when cats and dogs came out. Come on. Stop being a derp. Although, after what your dad just pulled, I guess I can't blame you for having brain damage. He obviously does. Okay. <laughs> oh, Lord. You want it to paint a pop art painting, so why are you painting a realism painting? Crazy girl. Mm-hmm. Great. At least toddler's traits usually go up pretty fast, just so I can count those towards the, um, the, uh, points for knowledge, which is max skills. Here, eat what's left of that kid. Go, go eat the stupid fruit cake. Come on. At least with no furniture, I don't have to worry about him walking 20 miles to <laughs> go sit in some stupid chair. <laughs> okay. Now oh, we're getting more age bombs. Nicholas is a toddler. Courtney's a toddler. The kids were just born. I guess so was this one. Okay, he's happy now, but he's going to have a sugar crash in about a second. What are you doing? Oh, you're throwing stuff away. Alright, you need to sell this. And I'll tell her to paint a pop art painting so she can get a couple points. Not that we're planning on buying Kira a potion. He's lucky we haven't murdered him, honestly. <laughs> I'm tempted. Alright. Small pop art painting. Oh, I forgot to check her reputation to make sure nobody oh. saw her little uh, oh. encounter with Bella. I'm pretty sure nobody did because nobody reacted. Oh. <laughs> so... See, I don't know if this is working, because it wasn't working before. Alright, check reputation. Oh, it is working now. Didn't work before. Nope, nobody saw. Got away with it. Yes. Oh. And Mortimer should thank me, honestly. Kid, where the hell are you going? Ooh. Oh, I'm getting child support. I don't know if that's against the rules of the Legacy <laughs> Challenge, but... It's the way my game works. All right, so now our bills are up to about 410 a week. We'll just round up to 500 to be safe. All right. I seriously don't know what to do about Akira, though. I don't know what to do about him. Because he was 
just as big a culprit as Bella. But at the same time, if I keep him alive, I get child support. Does that sound really wrong? Oh, sugar crash. <sighs> Kid, seriously. Stop. Just stop. Alright. Didn't even see how many were left. Five. Go eat that. Hurry up. Go eat that. I mean, he's at least making his mess outside, but I guess everything is pretty much outside when you don't have your house built yet. <laughs> Come on, hurry up and eat. Okay. That's about the easiest way to do it when you have a toddler, otherwise you're constantly going to be freaking feeding them. And it takes forever. Go sell your painting. Get some of that money back you just wasted. And all this toddler crap. Now he's tired, good. Alright. It's already 1am, man. Large painting, huh? Really? We don't have the money for that. It better be good. <laughs> she get that money back. Okay, kid, go to sleep so I can go back to playing somebody that, like, is functional. Where are you? Just set the frickin' plate in the ground. You don't need to walk across the whole universe. Come on. Alright. She does have to go to work in a couple hours. What does she want to do now? Level up in painting skill. Well, yeah, I want you to do that, too, because you need to get to eight for the creativity point and then paint from reference I was going to paint a picture of Akira but like I said I don't know if I can stand staring at him long enough to paint his picture so ticked off at him right now I really should <laughs> go into MC command center and um set her to her relationship with Akira to very negative but technically she should not know about that but trust me she knows Hence the blood in the backyard. Alright. Oh, that's the gift Akira sent the kid. Hmm, yeah, whatever. She's really tired. Oh, and she has to go to work too. Get up, you gotta go to work. Ah. In your diarrhea colored suit. Because that's just so cool. No, we are not hiring a nanny and paying tons of money for her to ignore the kid. At least they occasionally learn skills when they're in daycare. Alright, Aspen reaches into her desk drawer to get her stapler, only to discover that someone has encased it in jelly. Will Aspen retaliate with her own prank or ignore it and go find another stapler? I just can't be bothered, dude. Aspen doesn't have time for this nonsense. That's what I just said. Important stapling tasks await. The stapler near the mill room will have to do the job. Sophia Bjergsen had a daughter named Harley. Okay, whatever. Yeah, and they're still in counseling. Whatever. Dang, you tired girl. Oh, she got her permission now. Permit it to assistant manager. So she's still 9 to 5, Monday through Friday, because business is boring. She didn't get any stupid items that she's going to have to get rid of for whatever. At least she got a little bit of her money back from all that toddler crap. Alright, so. Assistant manager. Level 4, and I haven't really been paying much attention to her career, so that's pretty good, I guess. Alright. This is it. Almost. Okay, so Aspen's not a manager yet. Surely she's next in line for the position. It's time to build those people's skills for when she has people to boss about or manage. <laughs> okay. Oh, and she's already got the crap she needs for promotion. Nice deal, baby. And I always say when they get promoted. And let's see, actually, should I try to buy a little bit more of the wall? I don't know. I don't know. But 
you need to get food, first of all. And what is this kid's problem? Desperate for fun? Oh yeah, I was gonna have to get crap out of the mailbox. Oh, DJ girl wants to come over, fine, whatever, you can entertain the kid while I take a nap. Get your mail, so this kid has a toy to play with. <laughs> Alright. Eat faster. Hi, Yasmin. She just popped out a kid, too. I think the dad was that green-haired teenager who's now Yo. a young adult. Hi. Yeah, I agree. <laughs> Alright. Yeah, I'm gonna try to go till 2, but I might have to end before then. It's 1 now, so... Hurry up, you gotta get the mail and stuff. No, I'm not going anywhere. I got crap to deal with. <laughs> Come on. God, you eat slow, girl. That's right, they slow down like a million times once they're in a bad mood. Although she thinks she's happy. Alright. Oh, I forgot to put the vampire book away, too. What did he... What did he even send her? Oh, it's this thing. Fearsome dragon toy. Here, kid. Enjoy. Okay. Open. She already read that? When did she read that? <laughs> Must have been when I wasn't looking. Kid. Oh, crap. Can you get potty help from Yasmin here? Yes. I'm trying, kid. You're being slow. It's not my fault. <laughs> okay. <laughs> anyway. Yes, Yasmin. Will you please potty train my kid for me? The dude who's named after the angels. Adriel. He is now a young adult. Thank you, Yasmin. I don't have time for that BS. <laughs> and then I gotta get him some food. <laughs> That takes him two hours to go to the bathroom. So let's fast forward. Actually, it might take even longer than that. <laughs> this house is so sad. But I really can't afford to build the house yet. I gotta really get her on painting or something. But at least she did get promoted again. Without me even hardly trying. Yes, I know you're in a bad mood, kid. I know. If you didn't take seven hours to go to the bathroom, you could take care of some stuff. No, I'm not going over to your house, Paolo. We got issues going on. <laughs> so hurry up and eat, kid. Gotta put this back in the fridge. Oh, she's awake again, but this kid's in such a bad freaking mood. Eat, then sleep. Come on. I don't care how much desperate for fun you are. Well, Kira did one good thing. He got a toy, because I can't be bothered. <laughs> oh my. I guess if I do actually let her get together with somebody else, that blank space on my notes work for them. I was going to put Akira there, but I don't see it happening now. Will you eat faster, kid? You gotta go to sleep. <coughs> oh my. Eat faster. Why are you sitting on his bed? Now he's going to have an issue trying to go to sleep, isn't he? Good, get your butt up. 
Go to sleep, go to sleep. Hurry up and go to sleep. Oh, that's right, you gotta walk across the county to set your plate down. I forgot. Okay, hurry up and go to sleep. Oh, you're a really tired girl. Come on. No. Leave the kid alone. She's leaving. It's a little too early to go to bed, though. But she'll probably go to bed anyway. <laughs> yeah, she's going to bed, bed. But at least he has me left, so it'll fast forward. <laughs> Alright, whatever. Whatever. Oh, Sai is now a young adult. Hmm. Yeah. Jeez, what all is going on here? I've been going to work. Oh, Clara and Bjorn finally broke up. Having to deal with someone else's children? Who else's children are you talking about? Alright, whatever. Okay, hon, you need to go to the bathroom. Like, now. Hmm. Then you need to eat. Uh. What? Eat fruitcake? <laughs> Weirdo. Buy a toy, finish a painting. Okay, whatever. <laughs> okay, she needs to eat and she needs to have some fun. So I'll have her read something after she's done eating. I said after you were done eating. Psycho. <laughs> whatever. Whatever. No, you were not sad about Bella, but hey, her blood finally dried up. I'm trying to decide if I should move that bed. I mean, it's sort of centered, but I guess it doesn't really matter. Okay, she has to be at work in less than three hours. Hurry up and get your fun up, see if we can finish your painting. You were not sad about Bella. Would you stop it? You didn't even get caught. She is having issues with the dishes, though. Whatever. <laughs> she won't throw them away anyway. She'll just stack them up and then I'll have to drag them in myself. Uh, oh, crazy Sims. You need to finish eating too, woman. Hmm. Forget fun. You need to finish eating before you gotta go to work. <laughs> then maybe after that she'll have a couple seconds that she can finish that painting. I should tell her to clean this crap up, but she won't do it anyway. Oh, they get so confused when they don't have a indoor trash can or a, although she's kind of not even indoors or a kitchen sink just pick up the dishes and set them right back down Nod. Oh. yeah I don't think she's gonna have time to do all that I'll tell her but I'll just be canceling it out anyway I'm sure Yep, there she goes, just setting them down like a moron. Hi. Well, then what am I gonna do to you? Yes, you have to go to work already. So you didn't get done with your painting either. So good at time management today. <laughs> yes, we're sending him to daycare. Go away. Stop asking me stupid crap. All right then. But she does have the stuff she needs for promotion already. It's just job performance, which isn't horrible, but doubt she'll get promoted today. I 
Now, I don't know if I'm going to be able to stream tomorrow or not. Probably not. But I don't honestly know. Probably not, though. Makes 280 now. Alright. What is this kid's problem now? Fun. I'll go play with the dang toy that your dog of a father got you. Fast forward while she's in the bathtub, when he's playing, and then she's got to give him a bath. Even though her fun sucks right now. Welcome to motherhood. No fun to be had anywhere. <laughs> what? Akira wants to come for- oh, you will finally want to meet your kid? You finally want to meet your kid? I guess since Bella's dead, you've nothing better to do, right? <laughs> she's sleeping in the bathtub. Okay, great. Wonderful for you. She's got to eat. Oh, finally gonna meet your kid, huh, Akira? Now he's just gonna go jogging, isn't he? What a moron. <sighs> Kid's hungry again. Well, so much for her getting leftovers, because the kid's hungry. So she's going to actually have to cook something. Please stop playing. She's going to have to make food. Why can't they make regular tacos? Why are they going to make fish tacos? <laughs> oh, and he has to go to the bathroom again, too. Chick, why are you napping in the bathtub? Oh, my God. You're being very unproductive, Aspen. Kid needs to get potty trained, but he's got to eat first, and you've got to make food. Oh wait, no, maybe it's her that has to go to the bathroom. I've been flipping back and forth between them. Yeah, it's her, but he does need a bath, but sleep is more important, thank you. Eat faster, kid. Yeah, he really needs a bath. But sleep is more important. She's still sleeping in the bathtub. What a waste of time. Okay, you need to go to the bathroom. Make some food. What a visit that was. Okay. Alright. Don't know why she had her bra in the bathtub, but whatever works for you, dear. Okay. Whatever works, babe. <laughs> oh, back in the brown outfit. <sighs> I liked it when I thought it was black, but it's brown, and brown is horrible. Why? Why are you such a problem? Resume fish tacos. Actually, I could probably get a little bit more of the house done now. So we'll do that while she's cooking. That was some visit, Hakira. Came over. <laughs> Went jogging and then left. Alright. Let's see. Bills are almost 500. Well, they're a little over 400. So, we can't spend more than 400. Okay. <laughs> I think I'm going to move the bed just a little bit. Alright. I guess we'll do that. Look, we've almost got four walls. We're so living large now. We've almost got four walls. <laughs> okay, so she's cooking weird fish tacos instead of normal tacos. What was that? Mm -hmm. <laughs> There's nothing for her thing. I don't know why it popped up. 
Honorary part. Okay, then put those away. Yeah, I know, you're having no fun. Deal with it, woman. I hate something. So I don't know what to do with Akira. I don't think I could ever stand being in a relationship with him after what he pulled. Um, so do I move her on to another guy or just let her be single? Now, the more people you have in your household, the better for the Legacy Challenge because you got so much crap to do. Speaking of, what is her painting at right now? Five. <sighs> yeah, I gotta get her to painting eight just for that one point, and then I've gotta paint from reference. But you're supposed to memorialize the um, founder and their spouse. Well, she doesn't technically have a spouse. She doesn't even want to talk to the baby's dad right now. Uh, and I don't think she can paint herself, so I don't know how that's gonna work. It just says paint from reference. I don't know. Weird rules. Weird scoring. Alright, um... See if she can finish this painting after she's done reading, if it'll let me click on it. Notification wall full. Okay, what happened then? Yeah, yeah. Okay, great. Wonderful. Alright. How many points does she have now? 480. Can't really get anything. Okay, read faster, finish your painting, and you gotta go to bed soon anyway. But she does have the stuff for her promotion. She might get promoted tomorrow. Maybe. Doubtful, but possible. So many times tonight, like, somebody popped in and then left without saying anything, and I'm like, okay. I don't know. Maybe they're looking to see if anything mature was going on. I only put that in case I can't get the ma camera moved or whatever. But whatever. <laughs> oh my goodness, you read slow. Didn't I tell you to resume that painting? Who is that chick? I don't know her on sight. Oh, it's Billy Jang. Whatever. Okay. She just aged up. Finish your painting. She has to go to bed soon. <laughs> oh, and hurry up. Oh. Okay, she's done with it. It's actually not a bad painting. Oh, 300 bucks for that painting. So she made three times what oh. she paid for it. Yeah, but you gotta go sleep, babe. Alrighty. Yeah, I'm gonna try to make it till two, but I don't know if I'm gonna be able to, just because I don't know when people are getting home, as usual. <laughs> They're supposed to get home between four and five, but all week they've been getting home earlier and earlier. Because I was originally planning to go from twelve to four, but it's not working. Oh crap, you gotta go to the bathroom. A lot. So we're gonna have to wake her stupid butt up. <clears throat> Even though... Well, it's six, it's not too early. <coughs> Potty train your kid, please. And then you gotta try to give him a bath before it's time for work. But it takes him 17 and a half hours to go to the bathroom, so that might not work. <laughs> yeah, the more I talk, the more my cough gets to me. Hurry up, kid. No uh, Teddy again. <clears throat> I got a drink of soda, and that didn't really help. Let's try a drink of water and see if that helps. But I doubt it. Oh, boy. It's all pissy. Is it just because he has to go to the bathroom and needs a bath? Yeah. 
He's not too hungry yet. But as long as it takes him to go to the bathroom. <laughs> Good, now I can use it by himself. Thank freaking goodness. Come on, hurry up, kid. I gotta eat and I gotta give you a bath and crap. Let's go. <laughs> Plus, she's gotta leave soon. Probably gonna go to work without eating because this dang kid taking forever. Come on, let's go, let's go. Yes, I know. I don't think she's going to have time to eat, though. Jeez. Come on, come on. Eat pasta. Okay. Proud Ooh, mentoring, whatever. Well, at least he has that one stupid toy that the scumbag bought him. Keep him entertained somewhat. So yeah, I'm still debating on whether or not I should try to get her a new man. Like I said, she's going to be dead soon anyway. Yeah, dude, you got to go to work. Oh, binja! Doesn't cereal imply more than one? Whatever. Go to work, girl. I told you to stop eating. Go to work. Stupid animation glitch. Now she's going to the bathroom, too. Send to daycare, yes. Bye bye. Okay. See, I, I've, I'm so used to. The, that animation glitch, I don't even notice it, honestly. Fraudulent funds. Aspen has noticed a pattern in her manager's expense reports, and it appears that the manager is embezzling money from the company. Does Aspen report it, or try to blackmail the manager into sharing the profits? That will probably turn out bad. <laughs> so I can't, well, they'll both probably turn out bad, but that could turn out worse. I don't know. Aspen sends an email to the county department to have them stop the embezzlement. Perhaps there will be a management spot open for Aspen soon. Hmm. Okay. I was expecting that to go slightly worse. Hey. Would you two just break up so I don't have to hear about your marriage counseling anymore? 280. Kids back. Kids all pissy about something. Fun. Well, you need to go to sleep, kid. Who cares about fun? You need to go to sleep. She needs to take a bath, so help me. If she sleeps in the bathtub for another 12 hours, I'm going to be very upset with her. Okay. Stupid family aspiration crap. Stupid family aspiration crap. I could have her jog, but... It takes too long, and it's... Not like I need to buy a cure potion anymore. Oh, he wants to come over. Mm -hmm. Only because it's your kids. The only reason I'm letting you in the door. And now Caleb's inviting you over to his house. Boy, you guys must be bored now that Bella's dead. Huh. Nobody to screw, so you're calling me? Is that it? Is that how it works, boys? Alright. Mm-hmm. Yeah, All right, I guess I can get her a little bit more of her wall now. I should just get her the whole thing just to be done with it. Although it's going to really kill us money-wise. All right. Eh. Cost less than I thought it would. Let there be walls. Finally. Took, <clears throat> what? 13, 13, 14 days to get enough money for walls. That doesn't look centered. One, two, three, four, one, two, because it's not centered. I need to make 
Uh, one, two, three, four, five. I, I like it to be symmetrical. I'm weird that way. So this is going to really kill it. Five on each side. There we go. All right. Look, she has walls and a door, almost like a real person now. Yay. And just barely enough for her bills if they're the same as last week, but they're probably going to be more. Uh, I seriously don't know what to do with you, Akira. You're a scumbag. I did kill your whore, but I'm sure you don't know about that, just like I'm not supposed to know about her being your whore. Uh. Chat with someone. I guess I can do that. Not like I have anybody here to talk to. <laughs> yes, I said that. Paolo, whatever. How did it actually reset? This is the front door. I think it usually is good about that. Yes, okay, good. Meet someone new. Who's walking around out here? Bjorn. Didn't he just get divorced? I don't really want to talk to him, but oh well. Actually, I don't really need to worry about her whims. Screw it. Did Akira go jogging in now he just stand there staring at the mirror for some reason? Screw it, I'm not going to chase Bjorn all over the place. It ain't worth it. <sighs> I guess I should just get used to the idea that her and Akira aren't meant to be. He'll probably want to sleep with her, but... I doubt it will be anything beyond that. See, let's let's give him a look here. Sim statistics. Three times. Every time was the girl's idea. Uh. One? No. He's been with two people, thank you. Um, whatever. I must be the one they're counting, not Bella. So she doesn't count if she's dead? Is that it? Sure. Whatever. <laughs> whatever game. Sophia is aged up to what, young adult? Yeah, she just had a kid. <laughs> she just, just turned 20. What? I don't even want to talk to you, boy still tick to you, even though she's dead. <laughs> I didn't want to have to become a murderer, but you forced me into it, Akira. You just forced me into it. Just be lucky the bullet wasn't for you. I'm still pondering that. If it should be. <laughs> Alright. Let's see what has gone with her job. She should get promoted tomorrow. She does need another painting point. Actually, a few more painting points. What do you want, Akira? It's amazing how lonely you boys are now that Bella's dead. Now you all want to talk to me. Uh -huh. Or not. Uh -huh. Okay, whatever, dude. That's fine. Alright, what I was saying is she needs more painting. She needs three more in painting. Alright, so we got the walls. Do need walls around the bedroom, but that's not that highly important. <laughs> what? Uh. <laughs> oh, what? I don't even know why she was even trying anything. And he pushed her away, too. Whatever, dude. You really would want that next bullet to come for you, don't you? First of all, I don't know why she was hitting on him at all. That's right, Sims have no concept of their own world. <laughs> We're still supposedly lovebirds, huh? Sure. <laughs> Would you eat your food already? <laughs> so yeah, this is... um. Her talking with the baby daddy who screwed her over, um, trying to decide. I only let him even come over because his kid, who he still hasn't even spoken to, but whatever. 
trying to decide if I should try to move her onto it. But he pushed her away a second ago, and then he jumps on her. You do a split personalities, jerk. But anyway, um, yeah, I was trying to decide if I should hook her up with somebody else. Or just let her stay single. This dude, he does not know what he wants to do. He likes her, he doesn't like her, he cheats on her, then he pushes her away, then he kisses her. He, he's, he's so freaking confused. <laughs> whatever, whatever, dude. You're only here because it's your kid. It's the only reason I let you in the door. Not that there's really much to see here, considering it's a legacy challenge and she has no money. I don't get these two at all. They are so hot, cold, off, on. And since he cheated, I don't want to even, like, speak to him. But whatever. <laughs> it's his kid, so I have to keep him around. Just for the sake of the brat. But anyway. You Flirty penny. You're enjoying that stupid taco way too much, girl. Yeah, go start your flirty painting. You need money anyway. And it's not like you really want to talk to him anyhow. <laughs> okay. <laughs> She's painting with food in her hand. Whatever. Uh-huh. These two just make no sense. I do not understand them at all. I mean, technically they weren't in a relationship, but how low do you have to be to go off with another girl in front of the chick who had your kid two days earlier? It's just, it's so low. Even if they weren't officially a couple, it's just beyond low. Yeah, they weren't a couple, but come on. Seriously, if you're going to cheat, don't do it right in front of me two days after the kid's born. <laughs> I mean, seriously, let's just be logical here. Oh, jeez. Whatever. <laughs> You're only alive because that's your kid. That's the only reason you're alive, Akira. Because I really want to strangle you. <laughs> but anyway. Ask someone to go steady. See, I told I said I was gonna wait till she wanted him to be her boyfriend. She just says someone though. She doesn't say Akira. So we're gonna just ignore that right now. <laughs> Until she specifically says, I want to be with the scumbag that cheated on me. I'm not gonna ask him to be with her. Bye, jerk. <laughs> Again, he comes over and doesn't even talk to his kid the whole time. The kid was asleep, but still. Just checking to see if the kid looked like him. You're the cheater, not me, bud. <laughs> anyway, still carrying that food around. Am I going to have to reset her just so she stops carrying the food around? Alright, research workout tips. Buy a pool. Buy an instrument. What is that painting even? Wow. A cell to collector. Do I have to reset you so you set that food down? I think I might have to. She's like stuck carrying it. Oh no, sure, she went. <laughs> that was weird. Oh. Carry the food around for like a month oh. and then set it down. Uh -huh. Weirdo. Kid's gonna be awake now. Active, family hornet, ambitious. Yep, kid's awake. Oh lord, and he's super hungry. When isn't he? Stupid toddlers and the way they sleep until they starve. Not annoying at all. Hurry up, kid. Stop your whining, go get food. Jeez, how hard is that? Oh, he's going after that food. Okay, whatever. Whatever works for you, babe. Apparently that 
It was only like one bite. There. Eat already. What are you even doing, kid? Oh, setting the plate down again. Forgot that annoyance. It's like a toddler with no concept of the world, but they notice that the plate on the counter 50 miles away. <laughs> Alright. And he has to go to the bathroom, but at least he can go by himself now. I'm trying to decide. Oh, no. You jerk, kid. My goodness. I was gonna make him go to the bathroom, but I guess he's not going to. Then you can play. Gonna fast forward, because toddlers are boring. I'm hearing noises, and I don't know if people are home or just going to the bathroom. I don't know. So it's only 1.30, but... Whatever. Whatever. Alright, because I was going to try to go to at least two, but like I said, I don't know when people are getting home, and I usually don't stream when other people are around just because the walls are so thin. Okay. Come on, kid. Get your fun up. Do something interesting. Oh, that's right, you're a toddler, you won't. Just waiting for her to get up. Why is it not fast forwarding? Cause where hit fast forward. Whatever. <laughs> okay, so she's got what she needs for promotion, so she should get promoted today. She needs to finish this painting. She needs to get to painting eight. I need to figure out if I'm gonna put up with Akira's crap or get her a new man or leave her single. I don't know. Do not know. So many decisions and so little time because default lifespans you have no time really. Speaking of, how long got this kid to age up? Four days. It's the only good thing about default lifespans. Don't have to put up a toddler for too long. Because when I play with my normal lifespans, I usually switch houses when there's a toddler because I cannot deal. Well, his fun's up. Hurry up and get your butt out of bed, girl. Guess it is only six something in the morning, but still. What does she need to do? And she's actually not that bad. I don't mind about the dirty house, but beyond that... Oh, I guess you are awake enough to get up. You're just laying there for no reason. Whatever. Okay, <laughs> whatever. And that stupid thing she does with her hand is a graphical glitch because of my one mod, but I deal with it because I can't stand the game without my mods. You just gonna set them down again? Yes, you are. Brilliant. Brilliant. Okay, go get some food. Get some food. Okay, and she's got to be at work in an hour and a half, but she will probably get promoted. Does she have time to finish this painting after she's done eating? Probably not. Do you know? Let's fast forward a little bit. Yes, I'm sure you have lots of interesting stuff to say, kid. Alright. Stupid uh -huh. stuff you want to do. Got an hour before work. Oh, and her fun's crap again. Um, she probably doesn't have time to do that either. Try to read five words and get your fun up before you go to work. But no, you're going to sit and talk to the kid. Just go. Alright. Speaking of the kid, what's his skills at now? One, three, two, two, two. Since I have to pay attention to that for the legacy challenge, max skills count for stuff. But yeah, that's a glitch. I can't get rid of it. <laughs> but I'll deal. I'll deal with it. Alright. Why am I on the kid? Okay, 
she's got to go to work like really soon. So I'm going to unfast forward because I don't want it skipping over the time because sometimes it does that weird stuff. <laughs> so many people just pop in and then leave. I don't know. <laughs> hey, the elder with the long hair died. So yeah, I'm going to probably end in about 20 minutes. I'd like to go longer, but I don't think I can. Um, yeah, you're supposed to be going to work. Forgot I told her to do that so she didn't quit on her own. Ugh, I hate that outfit. Please get promoted just so you stop wearing that. Oh, I forgot to move the mailbox in the trash can too, but whatever. Might as well do that since I'm just gonna be fast forwarding for a couple minutes anyway. Alright. I always, when I change anything, I always save, so I don't have to do it again. That money she made to get the wall must have been from the paintings because she doesn't make that much of her job yet. Mm, kids always sad. Oh well. Welcome to life. Get a helmet. Alright, Aspen has... We just did this, like, yesterday, man. That's weird. Usually you don't get chance cards that close together. Harley, who was just born a second ago, is now a toddler. <coughs> Missing family. Seriously, dude? Not enough exercise. Yeah. I mean, chasing a toddler around isn't enough exercise for you. 280. That's spoiled. Yes, it is. Clean up. Get leftovers. Read something, and what is this kid's problem? Fun. Well, he's definitely taken after his mother. Every single day, he's whining about fun. Jamie. I was wondering if I want to go over to her house. Ugh, jeez. Um... I don't... I mean, she hasn't been out in a while, but she's having some issues right now. We'll skip it for now. Okay. What? Didn't I tell you to eat? What are you doing, crazy girl? I told her to eat and then read, but she decides not to eat and just to read. Whatever. I still don't know if I should leave her single, put up with Akira's crap, or find her a new man. What? Sick of your toy. Whatever. You're the one that was whining about fun, kid. Alright. I think there's only one left, isn't there? Oh, two. Eat that. And then go to sleep. Really, Brat? Are you doing that again? Just because I don't feel like telling you again. Because <laughs> uh, you gotta eat and sleep and I'm not gonna have her <laughs> flip over to her and yell at his stupid butt again. Aspen, you need to get off his bed so he can go to sleep. Thank you. Of course, that's after the 13 hours. Takes him to eat. Go read something. Stop. You're going to be in his way when he tries to go to sleep. Okay, good. He's going to sleep. And her fun's slightly better now. Let's see if I can get her to finish that painting. Oh, God, I hate that outfit. I just really hate it. She did not get promoted. Look at this. She's... That's rude. Alright, so yeah, so what's the next thing I want to do? 
Normally I build all the walls first. <laughs> they cost so freaking much. Guess I should stick to my guns and say I'm gonna build the walls around the bedroom next. But I'm gonna wait till she's a little bit more money. Painting six. What? They must be in the park across the way. And isn't he Morgan's Mo Moira's wife or husband? I don't. I can't even talk. Yeah, he is. He is Moira's husband. I like that painting too. That's a good one. All right, sell. So. That is Moira's husband. All right. Anyway, um, leave a drawing, buy a pool, buy a workout machine. But right now, you're just going to keep painting because we need to finish building this house already. You're not. Your mid's not too bad yet. It's not too terribly late yet. I try to wait till we at least get twice as much as the bills before I try to build or buy anything, but sometimes I just can't do that. Oh, now she wants a bath. Whatever. Okay. Oh, she did finish it. This, and she loves that painting. She's painted it like five times already. I don't know what that was. Must have been Dominic and Amea. Oh, Amea Metz, that's the chick in the net dress. Dude. But the point is, he's cheating on his wife. Aren't they all? <laughs> Hurry up. Finish your bath, get over here, sell your painting, see if I can make you make another one before morning. <laughs> oh, our fun's crap again. <sighs> so, dude, I have to go to work tomorrow, man. <laughs> I don't know. I'm like, I should take her out and see if I can get her a different man, but it's not like she has any time left anyway. <laughs> and I'd rather, if I'm going to take her out, I'd rather do it when she doesn't have to get up for work the next day, at least. Oh, she just keeps reading the vampire book when I tell her to read something. That's why she, how she got it as the red thing. See, if I would have sent her to the party, she's already whining that she's tired. <laughs> Go to sleep, girl. Stop being ridiculous anyway. Alright. Did you not put the book away? That's weird, because I've got to put the book away fix in the game. Usually they walk eight miles to put a book away. It's almost two, so I'll probably be stopping soon. Just because I don't know how much time I have. <sighs> She's having issues again. <laughs> okay. Do all that. Then put the book away. And then, let's see if she can do another painting before work. Oh, she's too tense to paint. And she's not even very tense, she's just tense. Whatever, weirdo. Lovelorn, that's why you're so tense? Seriously? Oh, and this brat needs a bath, too. Okay, anyway. It's like, she's got to leave in two seconds. She's too tense to paint. She's got to give this brat a bath. Oh. What fun. 
And she's barely got a house since it's the Legacy Challenge. She ain't got no money. Come on. Hurry up and eat. Give the brat a bath. See if you can do that before it's work time. He has, what, three days before he's a child now? I don't know. Yes, that's the graphics glitch still. Hurry up, give the kid a bath, you don't got time. <laughs> Come on, go, 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 go. That looks so weird, the graphics glitch when they're carrying a kid around. Alright, come on, come on, go, go, go. Yay, thank you, autosave, but I gotta go do stuff. <laughs> Plus I have to probably end the stream soon, but I haven't heard anybody get home yet, but I don't want to push it and have to end abruptly again. Alright. You're still tense, but this time it's from not enough exercise. Make up your mind what you're tense about, girl. Oh, god, I hate that suit. I really hope that her promotion gets her a different outfit, because that one makes me ill. Okay, anyway. Hurry, 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 go, go, go. See if we get promoted and can change out of that horrible outfit. <laughs> so, it's just awful, god. I mean, if it was another color, maybe I could stand it, but I just can't deal with that color. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, and her fun sucks again. I could tell her to take it easy. She's already really close to being promoted. Yay! Regional manager. The kids... Yes! See, that's a bit better. At least it's black. But anyway, promoted to regional manager. Aspen's been promoted to regional manager. Did they give her crap? Um, nothing really. Um, yes, he's back. Go read some crap. Alright, let's see what we can build now that we got a little bit more money, though. What are you all pissed about now, kid? Fun and sleep. We'll go to sleep, because that's more important. Alright, let's see if we can get the walls built around the bedroom now. Not that it's much of a bedroom. But she got a bit of a bonus, so hopefully we can do that. We'll move this... It's not where they're going to end up being permanently. Well, let's see. Could probably put that there. I'm probably not going to leave that there. Um, so, let's move that back there. We'll leave a little bit of a hallway there for when we build on later. And then we'll just put walls around the bedroom for now. I do four or five. Guess I'll do four because the living room's already gonna be pretty small until I can make it bigger. I don't know where to stick this crappy excuse for a bed. Okay. <laughs> I do no. I'll just leave it in the middle of the room for now. Alright, we need another door. Cheapest door, because we still don't have a lot of money. Alright, so I want the door there or there. Guess we'll put it there for now. Probably change my mind 15 times anyway. I'm imagining there will be a couch there at some point. So, let's see. Guess we'll leave the bed centered for now. Not that it's much of a bed. Alright, she still has 850 left. Surprise, surprise. Okay, so we've got the walls now. More or less. I mean, the house is definitely going to be bigger eventually. Um, I guess we'll get some lights next, just so we can see what the hell we're doing. Okay. Lights, and we're going to get a pretty cheap light, because we still ain't got no money. Bathroom. Oh, yeah, the kids' room. Got to build a room for the Dang kid. Um, sorry, I'm not used to having a kid two seconds after starting playing, because this is the Legacy Challenge, and I'm not used to playing that way. <laughs> okay. I forgot the one in the bedroom, didn't I? Got distracted by the fact that the kid needs a room. Um, where do we want to put the kid's room? 
where, where, where? Hmm. Looks like there's a little more room on this side, but not really. It's like mostly centered. So I want to build across her back. Which would I rather do? I guess across. So, uh, still don't have a lot of money to build much yet. Uh, I don't know. Back might make more sense for now, but... I guess we'll do this. Oh, ouch, that really hurt the money. It really hurt it. Um, so I'll put his room over there, like on the other side of the bathroom, which means move that to there. And moving the bathroom door would probably make sense at this point. Since his room's gonna be on that side. Let's just move this crap out of the way for now. Just go over there while I size up the best way to do this. Um, okay, there. Then, I need more lights, I know. Now that the house is bigger. Bathtub that way, sink that way, mirror there. Guess that will do for now. I do need more lights. Oh, she's really poor now. Dang, that killed a lot of the money. All right, would you get? All right. Let's see. Light. At least that light's really cheap, because it's custom, not Maxis. Alright, that'll have to do for now, man, because she's really, really uh, out of cash again. But now we gotta rearrange the whole front door, because the house is different now. I like things being centered. I'm weird, I know. Three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So that would be seven and seven then, right? Three, six, seven, three, six, seven. Okay. Move. Put that there. That there. What a lovely, fantastic house we have, isn't it? And we'll hit save. <laughs> and I think that's about where I'm going to have to end tonight because it's already two and I don't know when people are getting home. And I'm starving anyway. <laughs> All right. What is this? pie chart presentation. I guess she did get something. I guess she got a little bit of money now. But anyway, so I'm going to end it there. Well, we got the house a little bigger. She got promoted. We've accomplished a few things. Became a serial killer. Had baby Zaddy cheat on us. So yeah, things are great. <laughs> Can you hear my sarcasm? But yeah, I mean, I only played for like two hours, right? And Akira cheats on her. She gets promoted a couple times. The house gets bigger. The kid ages up to toddler. So we accomplished a few things, I guess, right? Not that they're good. And hey, there's one less Bella Goth hoe in the world. Thank you. I know. Everybody should owe me a debt of gratitude for getting rid of her after the crap she was pulling. But anyway... <laughs> I know, everybody loves Bella, but trust me, she deserved it. So anyway, me and my serial killer sim shall call it a night, even though serial killer means more than one, but that's fine. Anyway, so I don't think I'm going to be able to stream tomorrow, but I will try to if at all possible. So I guess I will hopefully see you in the next stream, whenever the heck that might be. Hopefully Friday, if not tomorrow. Probably not tomorrow, though. So anyway, hopefully Friday. So see you then. Bye, everybody.